わからないから面白いハイパーマテリアルって何準決勝を発見したシェヒトマン先生を覚えておるかのもちろんだぴょん2011年にノーベル賞を取った先生ぴょんそうじゃシェヒトマン先生が実は来日していたのじゃ今回は短い時間じゃがなんとシェヒトマン先生に直接インタビューができたのじゃすごいぴょんデータ科学を使って準決勝を研究している藤田さんにお話を聞きに行ってもらったのじゃどんなお話が聞けるか楽しみぴょん It's pleasure to see you, Professor Shechtman. I'm Elina from National Institute for Material Science. So thank you,、uh, thank you for giving us a great opportunity to interview you. So recently in Japan, a national project called Hyper Material is in progress.、Uh, the aim is、Called、to hyper material. Hyper material.、Okay. Yeah, this includes quasi crystals too. And then、uh, the aim is to innovate. Material science in hyperspace. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So today I would like you to share about your experience related to a quasi periodic materials. So, what is the first question?、No. Yeah, the first one is Ooh, this one. Oh, nice. <laughs> yeah. So, we prepare this one. So, I saw your notebook. And、uh, when you record the part of the version of quartz periodic material,、well, thank, you. <laughs> thank you. So I saw three question marks after the word tenfold. Tenfold? Yeah. So how was the feeling at that moment? Yeah. So、uh, the feeling was、uh, first of all, it was strange,、mm -hmm. but then I thought what it was.、Mm -hmm. I thought these were twins.、Mm -hmm. And all this work. Is to find the twins,、mm -hmm. which I could not find by the end of the day.、Mm -hmm. This is the afternoon、okay. of, the, of that day of April 8, 1982.、Mm -hmm. The previous base, which、mm -hmm. you don't have here,、yeah. is the morning work. This is the afternoon work.、Mm -hmm. And so I said, okay, tenfold,、mm -hmm. very strange, but I think I know what it is. Twins, I did all this work. All this work is meant to do one thing、mm -hmm. to find the twins. No twins. No twins. Okay, thank you so much. So, Quartz periodic materials are quite unique materials. So, like,、uh, how do you describe、uh, quartz periodic materials in three words? Okay, maybe a little bit more than three words. <laughs> okay. Maybe in three sentences.、Yeah. Okay. Quartz periodic materials are intermetallic compounds、mm -hmm. and they have a special structure.、Mm -hmm. This structure is not periodic, it is quasi periodic. It means that there is no periodicity in the crystal, but there is order. These are ordered material, but not periodic. Okay, so quasi crystal is very unique material as t h e are. So, how do you think about the potential of quasi crystal in the future life? Yeah, okay, you know,、uh, quasi crystals is, a, is an old discovery. It is now 40 years after the discovery. And many people around the world study the properties of quasi periodic、mm -hmm. materials. Now, if you find interesting properties, people say, oh, maybe we can use these properties.、Mm -hmm. So, what are the interesting properties of quasi periodic materials?、Yeah. Depending on the structure, some of them have very interesting magnetic properties. Others have a combination of electrical properties and thermal properties. It means they conduct electricity, but they don't conduct heat very well, which is not common. Because usually、yeah. it goes together.、Mm -hmm. So people say, ah,、oh, we need such material <laughs> that conducts electricity but not, not heat. So maybe we can use that.、Yeah. Um, they have interesting friction and wear、mm -hmm. properties. So maybe we can use them in car engines or in frying pans or、uh, things like that.、Yes. So it all depends on the properties.、Mm -hmm. And because there are so many quasi periodic materials,、yeah. and each one of them have different properties, then、It's、the potential is fantastic. Yeah. Okay, thank you for your time. My pleasure. And,、uh, I, uh, we、uh, sincerely wish you all the best in your future endeavor.、Yeah. Thank you. It's、yeah. a pleasure to be here in Japan again. Yeah, thank you so much. You're welcome.
そうじゃなこれからの新しい発見が楽しみじゃなまだまだわからないことがたくさんあるから面白いそうじゃそれがハイパーマテリアルまた次の動画で会おうぴょん。